Hey y'all, it's Krista. Um, so I'm gonna start off today by saying today is Bella's birthday. So happy, happy birthday to my beautiful baby girl. And tomorrow is the big football day. So um, instead of watching my video for the thousandth time, uh, you should be watching football. Um, so I, I'm going to use my new uh, toy and I'm actually going to do a straight pour and I'm going to spin it while I'm pouring it out of the cup. So we'll see how this goes. I'll get my husband to get us down to the canvas and we'll get started. Okay, so let's go through what I'm using today. I am using Amsterdam Phthalo Green. And I'm also using the Amsterdam titan uh, Titanium White. And then I'm using a Molten Metals Chroma, and this is the Rojo Gold. And Modern Masters, this is Flash Blue, and this is a quart size. Um, that was an awesome find. In my Amsterdam White, I added one tablespoon of the Deco Art Satin Enamel in the Pure White. And I'm using 24K, of course. I always use 24K. And in my Phthalo Green, I added some Sargent Art Acrylic Pearlescent. So we're going to see how this all goes today. I'm going to use my 16 ounce cup, but this time I'm really going to only fill it to 16 ounces. So let's get this started. Oh, wait, I didn't tell you this one. I'm using Venetian Blue Modern Masters. Forgot about that one. Okay, so I'm going to start with the blue flash, but just a tiny bit of it. And then I'm going to use, oh, I didn't tell you about this one. This one is the Deep Turquoise, and I don't know what happened to my, um, and it's a deco art. It's a Deep Turquoise, and it's a texture one, so it's a little bit thicker, so you don't really have to use the one part. You only have to use a little bit because mix just soaks it all up. And... Then I'm going to use 24K. And I'm gonna lock it in with my white. Just a little bit. And then I'm going to use the Venetian Blue. And I'm gonna kinda of go heavy on that one. And then I will, what do I want to use? Um, I'll use the Rojo Gold. Okay, and this is a 20 by 20 inch canvas and I pre-painted the edges um, because the Modern Masters is actually an opaque color so I wanted to make sure that um, I didn't have weird sides. And then I think I'm gonna put the white on top of that row hole. And then I'll use a phthalo green that's mixed with that pearlescent. But I don't want to use too much green because green will take over an entire painting. It's like crazy pants. And then I'll use the gold, trying to lock in that green Instead of locking in the gold, I'm trying to lock in that green so it doesn't go all crazy. Then I'll lock the gold in with some white. And I'll go back into the deep turquoise. And go heavy on that one this time. And on top of that, I'm gonna put the blue, the flash blue. And now what do I want to do? Let's use the Venetian blue again. 
I'm gonna go heavy on that. And do gold. As y'all know, I love gold, so put it in as much as I can, right? Lock it in with the white. And I'll use the Rojo. Go kind of heavy that up with that one. And put white on top of that. Just a little bit this time though. And then I will use the turquoise blue. I'm almost at my 16 ounces, so you're gonna see me stop here pretty soon. Okay, I'm gonna set that aside because I'm not gonna use that again. I think I'll lock that in with the Venetian blue. Set that aside. Keep my white. And then I think I'm just gonna put gold because I think I'm gonna put gold down as my puddle. Okay, put that off to the side in case I need a flow extender and get the dog hair off of my canvas. All right, so I'm gonna lay down a little puddle. Something to pour onto. I'll set that aside. All right, I'm gonna put some gloves on. And I'm looking at bubbles, but I don't know if I want to tilt them or torch them or not. Maybe I'll make a cool cell or something. Who knows? Today is a day of experimenting, right? But I'm gonna swirl it around a little. Every day that I layer a cup, I learn. Sometimes I like things, sometimes I don't like things, and so it's a learn every day. All right, let's do this. I am loving how this is coming out, spinning the whole canvas around. Wow, we. And the green actually isn't taking over, it's actually adding awesomeness to it. This is super cool, y'all. And, sorry, I'm focused to catch it. Oh, we caught it good. Yay. Okay. Oh my. Super cool. All right. So, I am going to water down my white and use my white as my flow extender. Or do I want to, yeah, I want to add it in my white. the white has that satin enamel in it. This is really cool right in here. That Rojo is really awesome. Okay, we're just gonna pour this around. my cup okay we're done with that and yep I'm gonna 
Here's my omelet turner. I'm gonna spread this out. Oh, I'm definitely moving that. I didn't think it was gonna be in the way. I was mistaken. Okay, we're almost there. And then we're gonna torch it and then we're going to tilt it. Wow, we so pretty. You know what? I just noticed that my torch lit on the first strike. Maybe that's a good omen that the Browns are going to win. If I can do it, so can they, right? All right, let's swirl this around and see what we got. All I'm doing is kind of seeing which direction things want to stretch in. I'm loving this phthalo green. And I think I'm going to take it off the corner by y'all first. I'm going to bring it back. And then I think I'm going to go down to this corner. Are these cells opening up, y'all? I'm in total concentration mode. It's hard to talk and tilt. Okay, then I'm going to bring that back. And then look, I can sit it down and I can spin it instead of having to turn it around. So awesome. I love this thing. Okay, then we're going to take it down to this corner over here. Well, it has taken its sweet old time. And we're almost there, we're almost there. And then we'll bring it back. And then it's gonna stretch out those bands that just happened right here. And I'm gonna take it down to the final corner. My husband is making a pot pie in the oven it's one of those big ones you can get at Costco. My whole house smells so good right now. All right, now I'm gonna bring that back. And then I don't, I don't know what I wanted to do here. I think I'm gonna take it down this way. Stretch that corner out. and then make it go this way. Oh, this piece is cool. All right. I have swirly cells. I have got all kinds of things going on in here. All right, let me take my gloves off. And I am going to bring y'all down for a close up. I'll get my edges after. There's my baby. It's her birthday. <laughs> my sweet.
sweet little Bella. Okay. This is an awesome piece. And look how the green did not take over. It's just kind of accenting. Awesome stuff. These little bubbly cells. See how the green is just, it's just accenting things instead of being all crazy because we all know green's crazy, crazy. That's cool right in there. That's gonna, that's that blue flash. So when it dries, it's gonna be super amazing. Look at these cells right here and the transparency. Ah, so awesome. The lines. Just the crazy little cells. Look at this little cell right there. I've got another cool one. Look at that one right there. All right, this is a cool piece. That looks like it has a little face in it. How funny. Okay, y'all. I thank y'all for watching, and I will see y'all soon. Have a beautiful day. Bye.